Details, Jerry, please. Yeah, I mean, what we're reporting now is that, you know, this merger review has gone into a next phase where, um, you know, AT&T and Time Warner are talking to lawyers at the Justice Department about, um, you know, approving this deal with conditions. Um, you know, there's been a lot of speculation about whether this deal is going to go through. Uh, President Trump has criticized CNN and it suggested that he might use that as leverage to potentially block the deal. Uh, but what we're, we're hearing is that actually the, the Justice Department and AT&T and Time Warner and as well as other programmers are talking about ways that this deal could go through and then there'd be conditions attached to the deal that uh, would prevent AT&T from harming some of its rivals. Jerry, what amazes me is that DOJ lawyers are starting talks without their new boss being able to weigh in. Yeah, so I mean, that's, I mean, another thing that we're hearing right now is that, um, you know, premium channels, some of HBO's rivals are concerned about possibly, um, you know, AT&T's DirecTV using HBO to discriminate against other premium channels like Showtime and Stars. So that's one of the things that's being considered right now as possible conditions on that. Yeah, and it would seem like you would need to have an administrative position on net neutrality as well for, the, for this to proceed. You, you know, we don't, we don't know where we are with this administration yet, so I'm, I'm, I'm not quite sure how anybody is supposed to negotiate this. What are the assets that either company could sort of forfend in order to have this go through? Well, I mean, you know, there's certainly going to be, um, you know, if you look at Comcast, NBC, a lot of, there's a lot of comparisons to that deal. So there would be, um, you know, one of the things that's being discussed is potential conditions on HBO. Uh, for example, not um, allowing people to watch HBO, um, the streaming version of HBO on their phones and not have that count towards your data, whereas other channels might count towards your data. So there really is some concern about, um, you know, how AT&T could use HBO. Um, you know, in terms of packaging and favoring it in terms of distribution.